Pamplona Mayor Janice de Gamo says she plans to make public a video of her husband, Negros Oriental Governor Roel de Gamo, saying the Tevez brothers were threatening his security. In a television interview, de Gamo says suspended Negros Oriental Representative Arnie Tevez and his younger brother, former Negros Oriental Governor Henry Tevez, were, quote, sources of threats to Roel's life. When asked about where the slain governor got such information, the Pamplona local chief said uh, her husband was receiving intelligence reports about the threats to his life. Inquirer.net has reached out to Arnolfo Tevez's a legal counsel to seek a comment from the Tevez brothers, but has received a no response so far. Meanwhile, Senator Bato de la Rosa denies accusations that he is favoring the Tevez family, saying he is not a lapdog of the controversial political clan. De la Rosa is currently leading the Senate Public Order Panel's inquiry into the brazen murder of Negros Oriental Governor Roel de Gamo and other political killings in the country. Suspended Negros Oriental Representative Arnie Tevez is tagged as the key orchestrator in the killing of Degamo and eight others in Pamplona, Negros Oriental, last March 4. I would uh, answer that allegation na hindi po ako kaya bayaran kahit gaano kayaman ni Tevez, hindi po kaya bayaran ako ng kahit sino man. So yun po ang aking disclaimer. Hindi po ako nababayaran, hindi po ako naging tuta, at hindi pa ako related sa mga Tevez uh, for uh, full disclosure uh, purposes. In a related development, Interior Secretary Benher Abalos says he would personally oversee the safety of Arnie Tevez once he decides to return to the country and face the allegations against him. According to De La Rosa, Tevez reasoned that he was under threat and might get killed if he returned to the country. For his part, Abalo says he would coordinate with the Philippine National Police to ensure the congressman's safety.